Good morning, Texas. Day one of the conference, or last night, I saw all the footage that I took. Most of it looked pretty good for my first time uh, really vlogging. Uh, I have no clue what Jason's got, but he's got a real camera. So, I'm hoping that the, the image disparity isn't that big. I'm shooting on a Nexus 6 Plus, no, 6. That's, a, that's the iPhone lingo. I hate iPhones. I'm shooting on a Nexus 6P. Might actually stand for plus. Might stand for plus. I hope not, or at least I don't think so. He's shooting on a real camera. So the difference is going to be, the difference is gonna be that he doesn't turn off his camera on accident. I've done that a couple times. Yesterday I did it as well. So I made some coffee with the complimentary coffee that they give you in a little bag. You stick it in this thing. Stick it in here. You put the water in the top. Plug it in. And then you turn it on and make sure that this thing's all the way in. And literally in about 30 seconds or so, you have yourself some, well, I would say delicious coffee. I mean, this is all right. So, it's about 5.30 a.m. Just trying to get up at six. I woke up a little early. I woke up several times, actually. But, let's get ready for the day. Shall we? There we go. I got my fancy dance. Not what I thought was gonna happen for some dumb reason. Uh, I've got my hair, wham, done. Just a quick little thing in the front. I did grow up in the age where I spiked all my hair, all of it, all of it. That got tiresome over the years. At some point in high school, I stopped. I stopped probably around like 2005. Just I got to high school, went through like a year, and went, I'm done. Nope, that's not happening anymore. Literally was taking like a half an hour in the morning because it's like all my hair, all of it. I mean, it looked cool. I liked it at the very least. I don't want to say that it got me dates. There's actually no clue, but I liked it. So for those of you asking, this is what I use uh, for my, my toothbrush, my toothpaste, Crest Complete with scope. Normally we use just regular Crest Complete without scope at home, uh, but for travel sizes, uh, this is the only one they have. Which by the way, for travel sized stuff, that was the only thing I needed to buy travel size. Uh, apparently the TSA requires that it needs to be like 3.4 ounces or smaller. Toothpastes, uh, the regular sizes don't come under 3.4 ounces. This is just a regular thing of uh, power putty, I guess is what it's called. Fiber spikes, this is what I used in my hair. I, I didn't have to buy a, reg a special thing. This is three ounces. That was able to go on the plane. Regular thing of Old Spice Amber, 30% bigger too. 3.4 ounces exactly. So I was able to just get a new thing of deodorant, a regular thing of deodorant, no travel size, so I was able to get the smell that I wanted, which, by the way, amber is the color of your energy. You know, for all you 311 fans out there. And then this was the biggest mystery for me, and it's the Old Spice Refresh Body Spray, and I, I like to use this um, not as a cologne, but as a cologne substitute, especially when I'm out and about and I don't have anything else to to really use on me. Amber is the color of your energy. So this is 3.75 ounces. But the thing is, is that the TSA doesn't have a requirement for aerosols. Actually, for the most part, it says aerosols. No, no aerosols. Uh, you, you, you have an aerosol, we apologize. We apologize, but you know, aerosols we can't really do, so. And it's really funny too, because it for checked baggage, so that you leave it the you know at the, the gate or at the terminal, and they put on the plane for you. 
It actually specifies usually that you don't have a, a 3.4 ounce restriction requirement. But for aerosols, there's like a big red X on it. And then for carry-ons, where they usually have more restrictions, it says aerosols and it's got like a yellow question mark. So the only thing that does, and it doesn't specify a size, it just kind of more or less says, we may or may not take this, sorry. But they want you to be able to put your toiletries in a quart bag. And that's probably why you saw plastic bag in there. That's a quart bag. I fit the toothpaste, the deodorant, and uh, the spray in there. They didn't question me at all and in, or in Portland, Oregon. And they have pretty tight security, actually, in Portland. Um, I actually had to get, walk in and, and put my hands up, um, do a full body scan and everything. And uh, was, everything was fine. Uh, they let me on. Um, it's a little ridiculous, if I'm being honest, uh, only because it's just, you feel like cattle just kind of being shuttled through. It's a little, it's a little weird. But in all honesty, I made it through security in literally like five minutes. And the Portland airport security line is really long. So it could have been worse. I think uh, TSA pre-check um, is going a long way nowadays. And it's a it's kind of a way for them to capitalize on their shitty lines and make more money, you know. I think it's like 80 bucks for five years and you have to qualify and I think if you don't qualify, you don't get your money back. So, woohoo, uh, airports. So it's really weird, but you know, hey, we made it here just fine. Uh, Jason drove, so he don't have to deal with any of that except for the drive. My vlogging arm is not getting any better. Um, <laughs> it hurts. So that's my, my code word to say I'm done for right now. My arm hurts and I'm, I'm losing my angle. So uh, next stop is going to meet Jason for the first time in person. Obviously I know Jason, he pays you know, my salary. I talk to him literally every day. I kind, you know, I would consider them family and I hope that they would consider me family, uh, but I've never met them in person. So now it's about time to go do so. Yes, there's watermelon. There you go. That. He took his sweet time and Amber likes watermelon. That's what I'm just now learning. Uh, he's finally here. He's running from me. <laughs> we interrupt this regular scheduled video uh, for an Amber alert on all our phones at the same time. And we don't even live here. That's creepy. We don't even have the same area code. We have two different area codes from two different states. And they still mailed us. Yes. Yes, yes. I think he's shy on camera. I'm just I now learning this. Bit, yeah. All right, well, see, I'm not. Yeah. And I've watched thousands of vlog footage, so I know how to do this. Sure. Right? So. Sure. I'm not so great at it. Amber's getting some breakfast. I'm hungry, but I don't, I don't, I don't want this. I want something from Texas, not from the hotel. That's there just generally, yeah. I came here to eat, and the first thing I ate here was a burger. So I'm already not on a good playing field. We're gonna head to the convention center. And then we're gonna take a tour of it at this point. Hopefully Billy and Jay are there. We get to meet them. Pat might be there, so we'll let you guys know what's going on. Speaking of videos, Jason was talking about the video for the weekly update. So I figured I would I would take my video of my own. And by the cadence of me recording versus him recording, I have a feeling that Jason has like 10 minutes total of their trip of vlog footage. Well, so, you know, you're gonna be seeing probably a lot of me. I have a feeling, he's laughing, he's, I'm probably right. So the uh, bar top is here. Bar top is looking sexy. Uh, Monster Arcades did a fantastic job on this. I kind of want one. Except Jason doesn't pay me that well, so uh, it's gonna be a couple of years at that rate. But uh, yeah, no, it's um, great. Ah, oh, this is the convention center. Looking awesome, everyone's getting set up early in the morning. That's Amber, that's Jason. And yeah, hopefully we're gonna get something to eat that doesn't cost $20 at the uh, hotel. Yes. I'm looking at you, Amber. <laughs> <laughs> that was annoying. I did yeah. get three drinks, though. But, 
That is true, but they're two bucks a piece for this. They're two dollars. That is, we could have just driven to a Walmart and literally all of us eaten for like 10 bucks. It may so, have been $3 a piece. Dear Lord, that's insane. <laughs> I think but yeah. breakfast was 12. Yeah, yeah. That's a lot for water and some eggs and potatoes and fruit. That's, that's a lot. But we're in Texas, so hopefully we can find Torchies is what I keep hearing. Torchies, Torchies, Torchies. So I gotta look that place up. So if I think of anything else, I'll let you guys know. Otherwise, I'm keeping my eyes out. I'm my eyes peeled for Pat. Uh, Ian's not coming. And Billy and Jay, I still haven't found them yet. This is the essentially the Game Chasers, you know, convention. And they're not even here. Actually, that sounds about right. All right, uh, if anything interesting shows up, I'll let you guys know. Uh, oh, nice. Fight going on here. Hey, hey guys. guys. So, we are the software inside of the arcade. Are you going to say something? We are the software. And so, what you can do is you have all your TV and your Never mind. I don't want to take a picture of the software. This place is huge. There are gamers everywhere. He's a viewer of our channel. Yeah. A lot of stuff going on at the launch box table over here. So, the software, you can download it. Uh, you can turn it over and the, the, the website's on the back. But yeah, you can download Launchbox for free and get started with all this stuff. It's okay, don't worry about it. You're good. You're good. And like I said, this is just a subset of stuff. I mean, we've, yeah, that's that's the, the go button right there. And so, uh, there's a bunch of stuff on here. There's lots of fighters. But yeah, we do need to get turtles. I should have thought about that, man. I'm sorry. I can't believe I can't believe I didn't put turtles on here. Press the exit button on the bottom right. Yeah, I, yeah, I, can, I do have X Men. I think there's, I think X Men is on there. Um, Simpsons. I've, I've played all that stuff, but yeah. Uh huh. Except, uh, oh, you know what? My fault. They're all, they're all favorites right now, and so I jacked that up. So basically, go up. X-Men's right there. There you go. The, uh, the, basically, what I did, I just configured it wrong. They're all, they're all favorites, and so they're all at the beginning of the alphabet, basically. Oh, good. Okay. Oh, yeah, okay, you favorited everything. I favorited everything in arcade right now. Okay. It worked otherwise. <laughs> yeah.
We're now green peas are blue. Woohoo! Woohoo! I'll be honest, forgot to record. Um, a lot of the con, but Jason has his camera going and we got lots of good stuff. Billy came by, loved the cab that we had set up. My throat hurts, my feet hurt. I'm tired. Day one of the con is over. It was fun. So uh, if this is day two of the vlog, uh, if this is the end of it, I don't know if he's gonna shoot anything else. I don't think so. Then uh, thank you guys for watching day two. I hope it was interesting. We met lots of you. Several of, uh, users came up. We had a couple people say that they only came out to see us. That uh, that made Jason and I feel really awesome. Coming out here and seeing people interact with the software and loving it is um, definitely humbles us uh, to no to no end, guys. Like seriously, we can't thank all of you enough. Uh, for those of you who even use the software for free all the way up to the people who pay and use it daily and, and, and get on the site daily, we, we can't thank you enough. So uh, unless something interesting happens tonight, uh, we'll see you tomorrow.